Good morning, everyone. Today's words of wisdom is, if you have the ability to dream in you, it means you have the possibility to realize your dream from I can. These words of wisdom give us bright future. Actually, Mr. Walt Disney, who created Mickey Mouse, said the very similar thing. If you can dream it, you can do it. In this book, I can, Master gives us specific ways of how to realize our dreams and teaches us what kind of mindset we all should have when we pursue our dreams. When we want to realize our dream, we need powers. Master teaches us two kinds of power. One is the power from heaven, which is a mercy of God. In happy science, you are given a lot of chances to take Kigan, ritual prayers. It is the best way to receive the power from heaven. And the other kind of power is that the power comes from within a human being. This means your effort, the self-help spirit. When these two powers combine, a miracle will happen. If you want to realize your dream, after taking a Kigan, please concentrate on your effort. Then there will follow the assistance or aid of heavenly world. I would like to talk more about making effort. Fatalism and environmentalism are just excuses for not making effort. If you are thinking about your destiny or about your unhappy environment too much, that is not good. It is not a self-help spirit and it is not a successful attitude. If you are or you are suffering from an unhappy situation or difficulty, that experience will turn into your knowledge and wisdom someday. So, please do not make any excuses saying about your destiny or environment, but believe in the laws of cause and effect and just keep making effort. If you do good things, you can receive good things. If you do bad things, you will be punished in some way. And please believe in the accumulative power, the accumulative effect of making effort. When you want to achieve something great, sometimes you need patience. Patience to bear time. If you would like to produce something valuable, you need a hidden period for the preparation. Master also mentions about Thomas Edison in this book and emphasized on the famous phrase, 99% of perspiration when you want to get 1% of inspiration. While you're making lots of effort, you can come to Happy Science Temple and spend some meditative moment and shift your mind to a positive direction through studying truth or joining the Happy Science Seminars. This will help you to have two kinds of powers. Then what will keep your motivation when your dream is not realized soon? That is a burning desire. Your strong desire will open a path to realize your dream. And lastly, and most importantly, your strong desire must be the sacred one. Your dream must not for your own benefit. It must be a dream of God. Your dream should bring happiness to the world and happiness to other people. Please do not forget about this. As long as your dream is the dream of God and making other people happy and keep making effort, lots of effort every day, your dream will come true because you have the ability 
to dream in you, it means you have the possibility to realize your dream. Please read this book, I Can, and this book, The Spiritual Message from Napoleon Hill, will help you understand the book. Thank you. Now let us recite Happy Science Prayers. Lord El Cantare, Master Ryuho Okawa, thank you very much for giving us your great light every day. We practice the principle of happiness, love, wisdom, self-reflection, and progress to make the world better with our brothers and sisters. With our gratitude, we will recite the true words spoken by Buddha, prayer to the Lord, and prayer to guardian and guiding spirits. The true words spoken by Buddha, Ryuho Okawa. There used to be the light in the great universe. The light is the energy of Buddha. People can live by this energy, and Buddha's energy has made human history. It will be supplied eternally. This eternal light comes from heaven and prevails on earth. This is the light of heaven through the prism of Buddha. There appeared the seven colors of rainbow, arching over in the sky. Here you can see Buddha's mercy. Yellow is the color of teaching. White is the color of saving. Red is the color of justice. Purple is the color of obedience. Blue is the color of thinking. Green is the color of harmony. Silver is the color of progress. These seven colors help each other and there appears Buddha Land. Buddha Land is shining brightly because of gathering of bodhisattvas. This is the land of love or the land of mercy. This is the land of wisdom or the land of teaching. Especially, this is the land of souls rest in peace. Real souls are the children of Buddha. The children of Buddha became real human beings. Real human beings have spirituality. The spirits are immortal powers. The spirits are immortal forces. The spirits are real entities. The physical bodies are the shadows of the spirits. It means you are the boat sailing down the great river. The great river is the symbol of the course of lives. Each of you sails down as a small boat. So you need a boatman. If it were not for your own boatman, you surely go aground. This boatman really means your mind. If your mind makes a mistake, the boat breaks into pieces by a large rock. And you also need a bamboo pole. This pole is the meaning of the two words. When you go down a rapid stream, you need to punt in a stream then you can change your course. The two words mean the teaching of Buddha. Buddha enlightened and spoke the two words. And Buddha's teaching became a gold mine. This gold mine suggests various teachings. These are another expression of Buddha's truth. It brightens up your days, or to put it another way, the fruits of Buddha's mercy. All of you, now, here, listen to me. Never lose your way, now and forever. The guiding hand has already waved. Please follow this white hand and go straightly on and on. Your lives are not limited to this world only. They have three aspects. The past, the present, the future. Your past have already gone by, yet still, your mistakes will be kept in your mind. That is the reason why you should understand other people. 
and you yourself should reflect on what you have done. You and others are not different. On the contrary, both are children of Buddha and brothers and sisters. Now then, love each other. Let us bring up each other. And it's time to forgive each other. This is the eternal law, which penetrates the present and the future. Yes, indeed, the light of the dark night. The dark night of this world is hell. It is also the same in another world. Since we came down to this world, the sun of the truth is scheduled to rise. Now we are watching rising sun. It will shed light to the future to invite sad people to Buddha land. Now here I command, there shall not be conflict in this world. There shall not be distrust in this world. There shall not be crime in this world. There shall not be evil spirit in this world. There shall not be the devil in the next world. Only the ideal world, utopia shall be realized. All of the people love each other, live harmoniously, believe in one another. That world is utopia. All of us could be the light of bodhisattvas, believing that the light has reality, believing that love has reality, believing that the truth has reality. These are the facts that should be conveyed. We, the light of bodhisattvas, get together, work together to keep right mind and live in tune with Buddha's words. Here we vow to do so. Prayer to the Lord Our Lord Alcantara, you are the source of all light, all power, all wisdom, and all love. May you give us light, give us power, give us wisdom, and give us love. O Lord, our Father, please protect this planet of love, Earth. Protect us from all evil and open a future for us. O oh Lord, thank you for giving us light. We give thanks from the bottom of our hearts. Prayer to Guardian and Guiding Spirit My Guardian and Guiding Spirit, deep inside of me, you are the fountain of life, the light of hope, the source of wisdom, and the shield of courage. Every day, may you help me develop my soul and refine my mind. Every day, may you give me inspiration and show me the right path to follow. Please protect me from all evil and guide me in living a better life. For this, I give my thanks. Lastly, we pledge to spread the laws of Messiah to the end of the world and establish God justice, let us recite prayer for success. Prayer for success. O Hermes, may you give me the strength to progress. May you let me feel the breath of success with you as my ideal. I wish to become like a clear wind of love blowing through all the world. O oh Hermes, please give me success and make my dreams come true. Thank you for your guidance.
Thank you for joining today. Have a wonderful day.